openly carrying a gun in a store causing alarm. That's a situation that played out in York County. The police responded to and it's now generating a big response from WGAL News 8 viewers. When we spoke to the armed man last night, he told Ed Weinstock that he was simply exercising his legal right. But it has become an issue that has the attention of businesses. And as News 8's Ed Weinstock found out today, the concern of the police department that responded. We received a 911 call uh, that a man had entered the store uh, carrying a, a machine gun was the way it was described. That's how Northeastern Regional Police Chief Brian Rizzo describes what happened inside this giant Sunday. Ryan Floor was openly and legally carrying a 9mm handgun with a high capacity magazine. The big question for Chief Rizzo and others in law enforcement is what happens next? Will there be more people openly carrying guns in public places? Chief Rizzo is worried. We don't want to have our police service uh, resources uh, be used to continue to, to have to respond to, to calls like this. Floor told me he plans to continue carrying the gun in public. Until I'm told that I can't take it somewhere, I'm going to. Chief Rizzo says he understands why some people are going to be intimidated. When someone sees this, they think, well, okay, is this, this could be a mass shooter. The chief's advice for people exercising their Second Amendment rights? If you're going to open carry, just, just try to be, be smart at what, what type of weapon you choose and how you carry it. In your County, Ed Weinstock, WGAL News 8. Giant's response to the incident continues to be a statement that reads in part, we respectfully request that customers not bring firearms in our stores. That is a stance that several large retailers nationwide are taking as well, including Walmart and CVS. State police tell us that while it may be legal to open carry in stores, stores can legally refuse service to an armed customer.